Okay everyone, so in this video, we're gonna learn how we can add a project to GitHub using Visual Studio Code, all right? So you need to have a GitHub account. So just go to github.com and just create an account if you don't have one already. You also need to download and install Git. So you have uh, this website, you can just go to Google, search for install Git. And let's go to this one, uh, git-scm.com, all right? And let's go to downloads and just choose which one you are using, Mac, Windows or Linux. Just click on download and install it, all right? After that, you need to go and open up your project that you want to add to a GitHub repository. So I'm just going to go to file, click on open folder. And just choose your project. I'm going to choose this one, add project to GitHub. Click on select folder. All right. Okay, so I'm just going to go and create a file. I'm going to go and click on new file. Index.html. Yes, so we have something to push to GitHub. I'm just going to add a basic HTML setup, like so. I'm just going to add an H1. Like that. Now we're gonna go to this one. Source control. We're gonna click on initialize repository and at any time during this process we'll be prompt to log in to your GitHub account and also authorize everything. Alright? That's perfectly normal if you're doing this the first time. If you cannot click on this one, that means you don't have Git installed, then you will find information and links right here. So just click on initialize repository. Now we can see that we have index.html with this U, untracked. And now we can add a message. This message will describe your commit. So in my case, this will be first commit. All right. After that, we're going to go and click on this check mark like that. Now we're going to go to GitHub. We're going to go and click on new to create a new repository. And just name this to whatever you like. Like so. You can add a description. You can choose public or private. In my case, I'm just going to choose private. And if you want to have a readme file, this is where you can write a long description for your project. And you can also add uh, .git ignore, but uh, you can add this later on. So I'm just going to go and click on create repository. And after that, I'm going to go and copy this link. We're going to go back to Visual Studio Code. We're going to go and click on view, click on command palette and search for git add remote. And just click on this one, git add remote. And now provide repository URL, like so, hit enter. And we're going to name this, so I'm just going to choose the same name that we have uh, right here. So test underscore GitHub. And just hit enter, like so. And now I'm just going to go and click on Publish Branch. Like that. Let's go back to GitHub. And let's go to this uh, project. And now we can see that we have uh, index.html. Uh, we have the message first commit. If you click on this uh, file, we can see the code right here. And if you are multiple coders and they have uploaded something, so let's say I'm going to change this, I'm going to go and click on edit. I'm just going to sh change something. So GitHub, uh, add project to GitHub in VS Code, like that. We're going to go down, I'm going to save this one. And if we go back to Visual Studio Code, 
we cannot see anything right here. That means I recommend you to do a pull request uh, before you're gonna code your project, all right? So if you go to these uh, three dots and click on pull, this will grab the latest code from your GitHub repository. And now we can see that we have a GitHub in VS Code. And if I make a change right here, let's say I want to add a paragraph with some example text, like that, and we're just gonna save this. So now you can see that we have this M, it's modified. Now can you just add a message, what you did, added a paragraph with information. Okay, and just click on this check mark, and just click on sync changes. So this action will push and pull uh, commits to and from test GitHub masters. I'm gonna go and click on okay, don't show again. Like that. Now go to GitHub. We're gonna update. I'm gonna go to the project. And now we can see the latest uh, commit added a paragraph with information. All right, you can also click on this one, three commits. And here you can see all your commits. All right. Okay, everyone, so uh, comment below if this uh, worked out for you. Also check out my other videos. I upload uh, web development tutorials every week, so check them out. And also join my Discord server, you find the link in the description. Subscribe for more of these tutorials, have an awesome day, take care and bye.